everybody. This week we're going to be walking through a short tutorial on how to start up PowerShell automatically in PowerShell ICE and automatically connect to my vCenter or ESXi host. So let's get started. Let's go ahead and bring up PowerShell ICE once we've downloaded the PowerCLI modules. Notice none of the PowerCLI modules are loaded. If I do get-vm, it's an unknown uh, commandlet. So we're going to go ahead and, and open up. We're going to go ahead and do dollar profile. And this is the actual directory where my profile is stored. So if I do PowerShell underscore ice and then dollar profile, it'll open it up up here. So we're going to go ahead and copy this command. Uh, basically, it's going to CD to the directory where PowerShell ICE is, PowerCLI uh, environment modules are, and then it's going to load this uh, PowerShell module that has all the PowerCLI modules in, in there. So let's go ahead and actually dig further into that and like look at what's occurring. We're going to also open up this uh, path and then initialize PowerCLI. And inside here is all the modules that are being loaded automatically. Uh, when I initialize the PowerCLI environments. So in addition to this, uh, I, I want to automatically connect to my vCenter. So we're going to go, go ahead and do a connect VI server. And then we're going to do uh, the IP address or host name that I'm going to connect to automatically. The username and password. So I don't have to type it in uh, and I won't be prompted if I want to save it locally on my machine. Uh, it's not best practice, but uh, you should normally prompt for credentials. And I'm just showing you a quick way of automatically connecting. So let's go ahead and uh, save this. Let's close it out. And now when we bring up uh, PowerShell, uh, both PowerCLI modules as well as connecting my ESXi host should work automatically. Loading PowerShell ICE. It's loading my PowerCLI modules, the ones that you saw in there. And it's going to be connecting my ESXi host. And sure enough, there it is. Let's do a go get vm, get dash vm. And uh, now that's a known commandlet now that I have the PowerCLI modules loaded. So, uh, anyways, that's a quick tutorial on how to connect to an ESXi host automatically as well as uh, load PowerCLI modules. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and please give the video a thumbs up. Thanks.